Alrighty guys, what is going up? Welcome back to another episode. In today's video, I want to talk about the top stocks under $100. So I hope you guys enjoy it and overall I hope you guys get something of value out of this video. And if you guys do, make sure you guys smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. If you guys have any questions or concerns, ask them down in the comments. And if you guys want to learn more about investing in the market, check out my course and you guys can use promo code DIVIDENDS to get 50% off. Talk about Fundamental, technical analysis, how to find undervalued stock, taxes, dividends. We pretty much talk about it all. And guys, we have a swing trading course coming very, very soon. So make sure you guys stay up to date with that. So now, roll the intro. Let's go. Bam. Alrighty, guys. The very first company that I want to talk about is State Street Corporation. So now, this is a uh, financial company that offers a variety of different things. They have a bank, different investments, stuff like that. This is a solid company, beautiful upward trend in the stock price. Now, looking at the support here, does look like there's some support around the 90 moving average line. If you guys can see that purple line here, it's right around there. Not to mention you guys get dividends so you guys can compound your money. Me personally, I definitely think this is a lower risk uh, investment because of the volatility. It doesn't really move a whole lot. It's a very sluggish upward trend and you get dividends. This is honestly a perfect investment, especially for beginners here. Now, the second company that I want to talk about is a company that does carry a little more risk, but also quite a bit of reward here. Look at the growth here. Lows here at $10, highs here at $73. This is Snapchat. You guys can see over the past you know, couple of months, we've seen some crazy sell-off with this. All the way down here, finding some support around that $50 mark, and we've seen some recent buying pressure entering this. Now, with that sell-off, that brings a lot of opportunity to invest. The reason why is because you never want to buy when when things are at all-time highs. That that does not that does not make sense, right? You want to make sure that we've seen some uh, sell-off with uh, the stock, and that's a strong thing. Now, not to mention over the past two earnings, we've seen very very strong earnings and beat earnings, so that's phenomenal too. Not to mention uh, Snapchat's revenue. Snapchat's uh, cash on hand, all of their financials have proven to be phenomenal over the past year, which is really, really promising. The company is not profitable just yet, but they are on the verge. So this is a solid company. Um, I really believe it will take off in the next couple of years. And uh, we're going to look back and wish we bought it here at around 54 bucks. But yes, Snapchat does carry a little more risk than, you know, companies that have been around the block, you know, more and companies that has seen ups and downs have gone through a recession and stuff like that here. Now, the next company that I want to talk about is PLUG here. Now, this is Plug Power. Plug Power is a hydrogen based company. This one, in my opinion, is the highest risk, but also the highest reward. The reason why is because this one is a lot more volatile. It's in some of the top growing and fastest growing sectors with hydrogen fuel cells. And they are working with a variety of companies to try to create a hydrogen uh, fuel vehicle, which is awesome, you know, because there's a lot of future for that. But look at the volatility in this. You know, it hit 75, it sold off all the way down to about 30. And now with that sell off, I think, okay, that brings an opportunity to invest because of this nasty sell off. You never want to buy up in here. You know, you don't. Not to mention, this stock has proven that it really tends to use this 200 moving average line as some support. We got some buying pressure in here. So now when it comes in contact with it in here, it's proven to act as support again. So honestly, if you hop into this right now at 35, set your stops below 30, you're risking $5 for this to possibly go up to about $50. So it's a perfect risk and reward ratio. I really believe Plug Power will carry a lot of potential, but also, yeah, a little more risk, but also, you know, you can make some money off it for sure. Now, the next company that I want to talk about is another energy company, ticker symbol NEE. So this one here is a perfect investment, especially for beginners. The reason why is you guys can get dividends from this. It has a beautiful upward trend, tends to use that 200 moving average line as support. So you guys can see we got buying pressure there, a little buying pressure there, a little buying pressure there. So yeah, resistance here at 87. We've seen some sell off here down to about 75. This is a good investment here. This is an energy company. In my opinion, we're just getting started on energy use. 
this company is uh, moving into the clean energy, which is phenomenal. So this one is a phenomenal, phenomenal investment, in my opinion, to hold for the next couple of years. But overall, guys, these are the top stocks, in my opinion, under that $100 mark that are very undervalued and definitely could 10x your money in the next couple of years. So I'm super excited to see really what happens with them. If you guys have any questions, ask them down in the comments, and I hope you guys got something of value. So that is it, though. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and if you did, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. If you guys have any questions, concerns, ask them down in the comments, and don't forget to check out my course. And We'll see you later. Remember to stay happy, guys. Stay positive and stay safe out there. Take care. Bye.